young age, me and my dad worked on defense. It's just as hard as it. Uh, in an age where you match the baseball as far as you can, defense is still important. At the, end of the, at the end of the day, the way I look at it is I want every pitcher on the mound to run behind me. I want them to trust me that they can throw it. If they're 3-0, they, they can throw a ball right down the middle, and if they drive it to the outfield gap, I'm going to get it. Uh, I don't take a pitch off, and that's what I'm going to try my best. I need to go perform this year. I need to go help our double air, triple A team win the baseball game every night. Um, let's take it day by day. I had a great college career, right? Like, great college career, but it wasn't what professional teams look for. It was a very slap the ball, get on base approach. And, uh, a lot of people didn't think I would ever translate into a professional hitter. I'm thankful that I failed in 2019 short season. Bro. I wouldn't say failed. Personally, I didn't have the year all It's the first time I've ever hit below two. And that's going to happen. It's going to happen. Professional baseball just keeps getting better. Um, but failing that year showed me that, hey, your college approach isn't going to work. Your body, your swing isn't going to work. So whenever COVID hit 2020, uh, we didn't have a season. I immediately went to work. I wasn't going to let a year without baseball ever hurt me. Early on, I showed signs of you know, hitting balls harder, but I didn't have the right approach. And thank you to the Mets. Midway um, through July, they sat me down and said, hey, we like what you're doing. It's there now, but how can we change that approach? Whenever I change that approach, it's great. And I think that's what the Mets are doing such a great job on this. They, they give us all this information analytically, but also extremely simple. They give you the best of both worlds. I'm telling you right now, that's what we're all really about.